Hey everyone, what's up? I'm Jessica. Welcome to my channel. Today I am trying out Gorge lipsticks. I actually already opened the box that it came in, but I left everything in like the packaging it came in and stuff. I haven't opened the lipsticks just yet. I got this in the package with the lipsticks. Here's the back. It says, we deeply thank you for supporting our indie brand. It was in British Vogue magazine in April, May, June, 2020. Best by your favorite 2019 Indie Beauty Expo and Best Lip Color Top 3 Finalist IBE 2019. But I found this brand on Instagram. I had seen an ad and I was like, oh, that's so cool. So it's lipstick that is inspired by the color of food. This brand is from New York and it's a female owned business. So I thought it'd be cool to try this out to see what these lipsticks are all about. And then I also got this card in here. Came with the cute little sticker on it. And I opened it. It was a thank you card. Um, Thanks for supporting our indie brand. Enjoy delicious fashion looking yummy and snatched. These lipsticks arrived very well packaged. And came, mine came in a box at least. And cause I got two bundles because I wanted to have enough to try for you guys. It came bubble wrapped and everything, but came packaged just like this. So I'm gonna open it now. Now you can see that I actually didn't open it. I just think the way it was packaged was so thoughtful and the card and everything going along with it, just it made opening the box even better. The first bundle I got was the Breakfast Club which has New Jersey pancakes and bacon bacon. So here are the boxes. And I just think it's so cute. Like, look at this packaging. Here's the other side. It's just so well designed. It's so cute. I've never seen anything packaged like this before. I think that is so cool. I'm gonna swatch these on my hand and then I'm gonna pick a color and then do my makeup. So let's swatch these. Here's what the lipstick looks like outside of the box. It comes with the little food on the bottom and it like jiggles and everything. Here's the top and here's the color. Oh, and it's so smooth. Here's what this color looks like on my hand. It went on super smooth. And it, I think it's actually lighter than how it looks. It comes out lighter than the actual lipstick color. So I think that's cool. Because you don't always want like a bright or dark or like that complete shade, you know? It's just like nice. I think they all smell like vanilla. They don't smell like the food that it's named after. I don't know, I guess it would be kind of weird to have that kind of food flavoring, especially when they have like sushi as one of their lipsticks. I like this color so far. I think it's a great color. I can't wait to wear it one day. Next one I'm going to try is Fake and Bacon. Dang, so cute. <laughs> so here's this one and you can see the bacon at the bottom. Super cute. I like that there's two strips in there. Here's the color for Fake and Bacon. Ooh. I thought it was gonna be like brown, but it's like a maroon color. So it's this one right here. And then there's the color next to it. It's a really nice dark color. I think that'll look really cool and interesting. And again, it's not like super dark. Like this looks dark, right? But it doesn't show up that dark. At least not on me in my skin tone. The next bundle I got was Bunch of Fast Food. This one actually came with five different lipsticks. I'll just show them individually. This one is Cheese Pizza. So here's this one and here's the little slice of pizza at the bottom. And here's the color. I'm just gonna continue on this hand until it doesn't fit anymore. <laughs> this one's actually really bright. It reminds me of the sauce on the pizza. I'm really excited about this red color because the reds that I have are kind of not lipsticks. I have one lipstick, but the other ones are the liquid lipsticks and I don't really use those because I prefer lipsticks better, which is another reason why I was excited when I found this brand because they're actual lipsticks. They're not liquid lipsticks. I know like there was a phase people went through where they just wanted liquid lipsticks. And it's like, how do you put that on right? Anyway, 
I like this color. It's really bright. I'm excited about it, but I like that it's bright. When you look at the ones from the breakfast bundle, like you can see that some colors are actually rich. This one is Southern Fried Chicken. I love the packaging. Of course, it reminds me of KFC, but I just like how bright it is. And here's the little fried chicken down at the bottom. And here's what this one looks like. This one's interesting. It's a very interesting color. It's like, I didn't expect it to come off looking like that on my skin. I think this one could work on me. It's a very, it's a light brown. It kind of looks like caramel. It does look like the color of fried chicken, which I think is awesome. My hand smells so good. It smells like vanilla. <laughs> it's a cool color, I like it. This one is California Burger. Love the palm trees on the package and the kind of like, I don't know, is that a sunrise or a sunset? Either way, it's so cool. Oh, my burger's kind of upside down in here. But here's the burger. <laughs> I just think this packaging is so fun. Like, it just makes you want to pull out your lipstick and be like, check out what's in it. Here's this one. The color of the patty. Moving on to this hand because my hands are small. Ooh, I love brown. Here's what this one looks like. I always get excited about brown. That should be fun to wear. I can't wait to see how I'm going to wear it. And then this one is New York Hot Dog. Here's what this one looks like. The color. Oh, it's pretty. It's a pretty pink color. I like this one. It does look like a hot dog color. That is so interesting. Oh, I think it's so cool how they managed to get food color on a lipstick. Like, I'm sure these colors like exist like in other brands and stuff, but the fact that they named it after food just makes it even cooler. And then the last lipstick I have is called Taco Tuesday. Lipstick. Oh wow, this one's super dark. <laughs> I thought the hamburger one was dark. This one's really dark. I can't wait to see how this is gonna look. <gasps> what? It's not even brown. It looks like a vampire red color. That's so cool. Wow. Oh, I'm so excited about this brand. So they have other bundles and they have other lipsticks you can buy all of these lipsticks separately you don't have to get a bundle i got a bundle because i thought it would be easier to buy bundles and show you guys versus just buying them separately and having that price rack up when i bought them they were having a sale and i believe they're still having it it's for spring and mother's day so it's 20 percent off single lippies and 25 percent off bundles and obviously i will have this website linked now i'm going to pick one to put on my face and do my face and get all fancy schmancy we'll see how that turns out and i'm not going to do my makeup on screen again just because i feel like it takes me so long i'll be back i'm really excited to show you guys what one of these lipsticks actually looks like on my lips and I'm gonna show you what my hands look like again. That way you guys can see one more time where I go. See you in a second. I'm back with the California burger. So that was this one. And here's the packaging for it as well. So that way you can see it again. And then here's the color. I just couldn't resist not trying the brown on my lips. Sorry, I just looked over because my mirror's right here. But <laughs> I think it looks so good. I'm super excited about these lipsticks. I think they're really cool. The idea, the concept, and the packaging, everything about it is super cool. It just felt super personal to get a little letter and stuff in the package as well. It came pretty quick too. It came in about a week maybe less it wasn't like next day shipping but it came pretty quick and i think that's awesome when stuff comes really quick and i really liked all of the colors i got i think they're all cool all unique yes they all smell like vanilla but like oh it smells so good i don't even care that it doesn't smell like the food i love 
that it smells sweet. I love the idea of putting the food at the bottom of the lipstick because then it just like reminds you what the lipstick is supposed to represent in a way. I think Gorge is a really cool lipstick company. I don't know if they're gonna do any other kind of makeup products in the future, but their lipsticks are cool and they go on real smooth. They are just really nice, very well made. I can't wait to see what this company comes up with in the future. I'll be keeping an eye out on Gorge to see what else they come up with and see if I can snag up anything else, some more goodies. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for those of you who haven't heard of Gorge or who have heard of Gorge but aren't sure if they should try it and if their lipsticks are any good or whatever. I hope this was a good enough review for you guys. The prices are high on these lipsticks, but it's totally worth it. I think they are really good quality. I hope you like this video. If you liked it, give it a like. If you wanna see more makeup related videos, give this video a like to let me know or leave a comment to let me know. And if you're new, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. I would love to have you here on my channel. Thank you so much for watching again. I will see you next time.